Hello and welcome back everyone to Universe Sandbox. Last time we took a look into this latest update where we got performance improvements, water simulation improvements, uh, and we did a big tsunami which was very nice, but I think we can do better. Mm. Yeah, the water just doesn't move quickly enough for me to get a real, a real reading on it. Like, it's fun to plop it down and see all the water just flowing in massive tsunamis, but it's just, it's so slow at moving. I mean, I know it's a technical limitation, but hopefully they can get over that in the future. So if I'm going to keep having an issue with that, and we're going to be playing around with sea level, let's go ahead and get the United... Not the United States. The United States is not a planet, fun fact. Also, this down here is South America, not South Africa, as North America is above it. South Africa is a country down here. Yeah, I screwed that up last time. I, I, don't, I don't know how... You guys have to let Spike get more sleep, jeez. Okay, let's see if we can go ahead and change the sea level on Earth. So we have 11.5 kilometers, and if I turn- Oh! Oh, look at that! I turned the east coast into an island! New York got an upgrade. South, South America looking real nice. Africa, look at those I. This is tourist. It's tourist country here. Ooh, Australia has looked better. It looks like it's been split into one, two, three, four islands. Wait, is that even Australia? Uh, is that a part of... Uh, I need to... Wait, no, that's F! <laughs> oh, it, it kind of looks like it was shaped like Australia. <laughs> okay, so Australia is over here, and it's just gone? That's Africa. Australia should be... Um... Oh, no, there it is. It's right over here. Okay. Alright, let's do some rotation. Pick it back up, see where it's at. Ready? Oh, yeah. Yeah, Australia is just gone. Even before, like, a lot of Asia. That... <laughs> this is so sad. This very different map, which Chile doing, doing real nice. Very good. Fantastic. I mean, it's kind of wacky to think about. You know, it's even wackier to think about. This is completely unrelated to the video. I'll, I'll just be completely honest. But have you ever thought of if when we were drawing maps, if if we had flipped north and south, like imagine imagine a map, if all of our maps were like <laughs> like this, like just by chance did we decide the other way? This this could have been it. It just, it looks really wacky, but like, there's no reason that we chose north to be north and south to be south. It, it could have been reversed. And then, and then this is what it would have been like. Australia would have been on top and proud. On top and proud. And then we would have all been the, the upside down people. They could have made jokes about us instead. It's really intense if you think about it, you know, flipping the world. Then the season- oh no, well, conceptually if we flipped it, the seasons would stay the same. But if we literally flipped it, the seasons would be reversed. Fun fact. Fun facts with Spike. Did you know that if you throw the moon at an upside down Earth, it will still cause mass mayhem and death? Also fun facts with Spike. I mean, there is- there's- <laughs> Yeah, <it's... laughs> Okay, but this this brings up a very excellent question. What would it take to flip Earth? Could we could we hit Earth in such a way that it flips and then stop the rotation so that it no longer flip? Look at the holes in the atmosphere. That effect just gets me every time. Okay, okay. I want to see if we can flip Earth. <laughs> Can we put Australia on top? Thank you. I, I just I just want to know. All right, so we're gonna try to do this with as little collateral damage as possible. So let's use a more reasonably sized object. We use Make Make, and we'll we'll fire it at the top because if we want to spin Earth, we gotta get like a grazing shot on top because physics. Think of like where you'd hit a pool ball. You hit the you hit the top if you wanted to roll over. Or, or you could hit it low as well, and then it'll backspin, but 
And then this needs a lot of force behind it, so we're gonna go ahead and get the speed and just do like a hundred kilometers per second. Ooh, look at that movement! Shoot! Uh, okay, so the amount of energy we've poured into the Earth here is a little bit insane. And it doesn't actually look like the axis moved. Unless... What, what, what is green and what is blue? Because I feel like the... Is blue the magnetic poles and green is the... Ro y yeah! Yes it is- Oh! Oh shoot! We accidentally deleted- <laughs> Okay, there was a little bit too much energy in that collision. I'll, I'll be honest, I, I could- it, it would appear we went a little bit too far. <laughs> okay. Okay. Fine. We're- <laughs> Our attempt to flip Earth is going to have to be a little bit less violent. Oh no! I know how we can rotate the Earth! Absolute big brain time! Oh, this is a trick I used to do in the past. Alright, nope, I have it. I have the solution. We can throw Maki Maki actually going very slowly uh, directly at the side of the Earth. And here's how. If you throw a ball that's rolling, Another ball, and they're not like on a table or anything, the the one ball will roll the other one is obviously friction. So all we have to do is get Make Make and we're going to uh, pull up our rotation. We're going to make it rotate <laughs> sideways and we're going to have it kind of act like a roller to roll Earth. This is... This is great idea. <laughs> okay, or a roll period. We're gonna make it really, really low. Huh. I don't know why that literally broke the game. Kind of odd. Um, maybe I went a little bit too small. Can I move it? Move. No, I can't. Oh. Oh. No, I could actually. Oh, Earth is dead now. Okay, that's fine. I'll just put this back here again and add a new earth in. Time, time is money. <laughs> okay, there we go. And this is going in what direction? It's going... Velocity. Yes! Okay, fantastic. This is probably going to spin earth a little bit faster than we want to, but we'll call it a success if we can just get earth to, you know, spin. Uh, for an example of how fast Make Make is spinning, um... We can't see it spinning because it's just spinning so- Oh, it just rounded to zero! That's not good. Um, 0.1. No, it just rounded it to zero again. Why? Why did it move it? Okay, what about one sec- No, it just makes it zero- What? What is going on here? I'm very confused. Okay, can we- Can we get- Can we get Make Make down first. All right, and get it rotating correctly. Oh, and now it's a different color again. Isn't that fantastic? Okay. Thank you. Could you please go onto your side? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Fantastic. Now we're going to set your rotational period to 0 0.01. There we go. 36 seconds. That's rotating pretty fast, but just for safety, we're going to set it to one second. Now this is rotating very, very fast. Um, very, very, very fast. I mean, even if we go to like, yeah, th this is, this is half speed. Here we go, real time. Um, so that's, that's quite quick for a, for a object in space to spin. And we just have to put Earth in front of it so that the rolly part of Make Make will strike Earth with great efficiency and roll it. Uh, the mass difference is pretty large, so hopefully we have enough rolling energy to make this work. Okay. Here we go. We're gonna see what happens. Let's go ahead and click on Earth so that we can see... The poles! Not, not the, not the Polish people, but the, the poles of the planet. I don't think I had to specify that, but I'm still... I'm still glad I did. <laughs> Alright, let's see if we can get some change in here. 
I should probably pull this up so that we can see the rotational period as well to see if that changes. Collision in three, two, one. Come on. Come on. Come on. You can do it. You can do it. I, I believe in you. All right, we'll wait a little bit longer. I mean, it's going to impact Africa at any moment now. Okay. I'm I am almost certain something will happen soon. Please. I don't I don't want to miss the cool moment where it collides. So I'm trying to be very <laughs> Oh, here we go. Here we go. Rotational period is 23. Oh, look. Look, it's moving. Oh my god, it's happening. Yes. It's being rolled. Here it goes. How far will it roll? Make, make, make us proud. The rotational period of the Earth is decreasing as well. Oh, how far will it go? No! Oh, that was not nearly enough. Okay, so it is impressive an object that small did manage to move the poles. But no, we gotta, we gotta do better. Okay, we have to go much more aggressive. We have to make Make, make just spin insanely quickly. Part two, the electric boogaloo. All right, we do it again, but this time we do it a lot more. So when we, we go to orbital period, we're gonna zoom one, 3.6 seconds, yeah, that's not good enough. We need better than 3.6 seconds. We, we need Z, wait, what? Did it just turn to 2.31 hours again? Okay, so for some reason, for some reason, we just have to go ahead and do Make Make first. I don't know why. Maybe because I I don't know. It's just broken. <laughs> Finding bugs with Spike since 2012. Oh my God! No, it. Oh, I have to like hold it down. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Come on, work with me. We're losing her. Okay, so we, we gotta put Earth in front of it that way. That's fine. When we do rotational period, we do 0 0.001, 3.6 seconds. That's fine. We're gonna do 0 0.0001 seconds. And that's going to be absolutely insane. I'm gonna add a few more zeros because don't tell me what to do. There we go, and now we're going to put down Earth. And now we're going to pray. <laughs> we're going to pray that this is going to go correctly, because at this point, a lot of things could go wrong. Alright. Slow down time. Play. Speed things up a little bit more. Turn off the move tool. Get a good shot. Alright. Here she goes. Here she goes. On impact, we're probably going to see the uh, rotational period of Earth change drastically. Um, that's not our goal, but it'll be a fun side effect. Alright. Okay. Alright. Fantastic. We're looking for that full 180 degree... T oh! 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 That was effective! That was really effective. That was... <laughs> oh! That's not really what we meant to do. It, it just... Now... <laughs> now Earth is spinning in that direction. <laughs> uh... But wait! No, it kind of is a success because it will flip upside down. Then all we have to do is get it spinning in the correct direction again. So ready? We <laughs> this is kind of cheating, but I don't care. Boom, we do that. And then, and then we get our good friend Make Make. Alright. And then we rotate this. This way. <laughs> 
to get the rotational force in the other There's no way this is going to work. It's already rotating so quickly the other way. I feel like we're going to have to zero out the Earth's rotational period by just making it really long again. Um, yeah, and then now... Oh! Oh my god, it's working! <laughs> this is so dumb. <laughs> yes! Yes! Australia is on top! Let's go! Uh, if you're an Australian, you must like the video at this point in time. <laughs> This is, this is so necessary. We're using planets like Gears. The funny thing is Earth is just accelerating at an insane rate now. Yeah, three seconds for a day. That, that sounds, that sounds pretty good. Oh, two second days. Well, that's, that's a little bit extreme, but we, we can still live with that. Right, right guys? Oh, one second days. Yeah, that's, that's, that's still a little bit extreme. But if it's really what people want, I guess I guess we can't take it away from them. Okay, now, now we're getting close to less than a second per day. And uh, also, we built a trench literally through the center of the Earth. Um, the, the ocean has been split in half. This is the most effective wall of all time. I mean, now the Canadians can't go to Australia anymore. You're welcome. I did it. I solved the largest immigration crisis to date. The Canadians going <laughs> to Australia. That's it. And it's solved all because of me. Wow, we're down to half a second rotational period. Alright, if we just speed things up just to get to the final conclusion. Oh, we get to a third of a second days. Um... After the explosion, it looks like things have gotten a little bit wacky when it comes to the rotation. It's actually wobbling a bit. Um, I think we broke Earth. I'm... Yeah, yep, no, we we definitely broke Earth. Alright, I'm I'm going to be completely honest here. We have, we have ruined it, but... We did come... We did actually accomplish what we set out to. So, thank you all for watching. <laughs> Leave a like and subscribe if you enjoyed, and I will see you all next time. Peace out. Oh, I... Yeah, I reinstalled Windows, so my fancy stream deck no longer is functional. I'm gonna have to fix that. Bye! <laughs>